Hey, what's going on, my friend? It's Jeff Newbert from ChasingStrength.com. And today, I want to ask you a question in this video. Are you hardcore? Like hardcore like Greg? Let me tell you about Greg. He stripped three inches from his waist in only 30 days. And I'm going to tell you in this video how he did it. All right? So let's jump in here. Now, I don't know if you know this or not. Most people who struggle with TPS, you know what TPS is, right? TPS is what I call tight pants syndrome, right? They only do so to protect that little flicker of hope in their hearts. And um, maybe you know the one I'm talking about. It's the someday flame when the timing is right or the perfect program comes along. And that's because their fire, right? Their inner fire has practically been extinguished from past failures, setbacks, and let's face it, downright dishonest marketing which promises a stallion and delivers a donkey, right? And who can blame them? And you know, who can blame you if you're one of these people, right? There's so much shady nonsense, too much shady nonsense out there, lies and false stories simply designed to separate you from your hard-earned money by preying on your hopes dreams and desires, right? Now, maybe that sounds crazy. Maybe it doesn't. But I know one guy who has sold at least four different workout programs and supplements over the last 10 years. Each one of these programs is different, right? And each one of these supplements is different. And each one was the miracle cure, right? That got his wife her body back after she had cancer. All right. So, right. She got her body back after cancer, but she used four different things. <laughs> so, Oh my goodness, man. Got a mercy on that guy. Anyway, that's why I love sharing real world examples of people who get results using my kettlebell training programs like Greg, right? Greg is a former college football player. In the last 30 days, he's dropped 14 pounds, but more importantly to him, he's lost three inches off his waist. So here's proof. I mean, everybody like doubts claims made on the internet. So I'm just going to show you some proof from an email I got from him. Okay. Here's the whole email in its entirety. We're just going to cruise over the underlying points. Okay. You can stop the video and read the whole email if you'd like. All right. But he said, I just wrapped up my kettlebell burn extreme yesterday. Final weigh-in was 263.6. Okay. Starting at 278, that's 14 pounds in 30 days. Okay. More importantly than the 14 pounds though, is three inches off my belt. I had to drill two more holes in the leather belt, exclamation point. All right. And then I'm going to go ahead and read this other part because I think this is super important. Okay. Most people think that you cannot lose body fat, get stronger and grow muscle at the same time. And that's because they A, don't know how to do it and B, haven't done it themselves. All right. So we're, I'm just going to show you this part that Greg said, and then we'll get on with the rest of the video. Okay. He said, I definitely gained quite a bit more muscle and can feel my suit pants as they're tighter in the thighs. The high volume of the front squats is no joke. I'd almost rather do heavy back squats instead of two by 32 front squats. LOL. I can button my suits again. And this time with lots of room to spare. I can also tell that my lats have gotten much firmer and I must've been holding more fat there than I thought. Shoulders are much bigger and more defined as well. And arms are defined, more defined than they have been in many, many years. The chest protector I was wearing has thinned out quite a bit too. Thanks for excellent programming and reminder emails. All right, so let's break this down a little more. As you can see, the weight that Greg lost wasn't just water weight. He had to drill two more holes in his leather belt. Furthermore, he said, I can button my suits again, and this time with lots of room to spare. And the chest protector I was wearing has thinned out quite a bit. I can only assume that means like the, the chest fat that some guys get, right? Now, obviously, Greg's pretty pleased with his accomplishments, as he should be. Furthermore, unlike many other fat loss programs, as I pointed out and read to you, okay, Greg gained muscle and strength during that 30-day period. Okay, just to review, he reports, I've definitely gained quite a bit more muscle, and I can feel it in my suit pants as they're tighter in the thighs. I can also tell my lats have gotten much firmer as I must've been holding more fat there than I thought. Shoulders are much bigger and more defined as well and arms are more defined than they have been in many years. Yeah, I, I just cannot stop banging that drum and just hone in on there. The reason people say that this can't be done is because A, they don't know how to do it and B, they haven't done them themselves, okay? And probably C because of B, A. So hopefully that makes sense. And as I mentioned in the start of this video, Greg is hardcore. Why? Two things, or two reasons, if you will. Number one, his results. Number two, his do-whatever-it-takes attitude to win, which is most likely from his college football days. Very few people achieve Greg's kinds of results because, A, they secretly wish they could do it, but don't believe it's really possible because, in many cases, they're jaded from past failures. B, the plans they used didn't work. And C, even when they do use the right plan, very few exist, right? I mean, this program that Greg used is one of them. They still don't believe it'll work. So they secretly sabotage themselves. So if you're hardcore or you want to be, and you're ready to punch new holes in your belt and get bigger, more defined shoulders and arms, then I recommend you use the same program Greg did, Kettlebell Burn Extreme. Okay. Again, I'll leave a link 
for it in the description below. Look, hopefully you found this video helpful. If you did, click the like button, smash the subscribe button if you're not a subscriber already, share it with a friend, and leave me a comment. Let me know what you think about Greg's results and whether or not you've seen similar ones. All right, until next time, my friend, stay strong.